Hey y'all, it's Chloe. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Oster Electric Skillet. So a few things about this skillet. Um, we bought it from Walmart for around $40 and on the box it said it had a hinge lid, which initially I was a little bit put off by because I know they can be a pain in the butt sometimes to clean, but this one I was actually pleasantly surprised that it's super easy to take on and off. So I'm about to um, wipe the inside out and I did notice that there was black residue on my hand. So make sure that you're washing this before you use it. Right here I'm about to show you just how easy it is to take this lid on and off. So the lid actually has a groove on the side of it and the base has a stand on one side of it. So here's the groove on the lid. And there's the stand on the base so you're just gonna pop the lid right onto that stand and voila it's just like that and when you open this up it's gonna be a very sturdy hold so that's great you can cook with it open or closed or on and off but what I like about this is when you go to clean it it's gonna make it super easy just popping that lid on and off of it so here's the power cord it's got um, just a standard power cord with it it's got a warm setting and all the other temperatures it plugs into a regular wall socket Okay guys, so I just plugged it in, um, I just washed it out and plugged it in. So far everything's looking good. Um, one thing I do want to note on is the cord that it plugs um, into the wall is kind of short. So that might be troubling for some people. Okay, so this is the skillet plugged in and all warmed up. I'm about to start cooking on it. So I'm going to go ahead and throw in just a little bit of butter. I'm going to be making scrambled eggs, so I just want to add a little bit of butter to the pot. So here's my eggs. I'm going to be making three or four eggs, and I'm just going to scramble them in here. So my eggs are done. That was quick for you guys. Um, but now I'm just going to show you how easy it was to clean out. So after I get all these eggs out of here, I'm going to just take a paper towel. It's not wet or anything. There's nothing on it. And I'm just going to wipe it out. And as you can see, everything's coming right up. I'm not having to struggle or scrape or anything like that. I'm just wiping it right out. Okay, and for the bacon, I'm going to be using five pieces. I'm not going to cut it or anything. I'm going to go ahead and close it up and let it cook. A few minutes later, and I open it back up, and now I'm just going to flip them over. And just close it back up and let it finish. Okay, so I'm going to give you my final thoughts on the electric skillet. Me personally, I really enjoyed it. I like that it was non-stick, that it was easy to clean off, it didn't produce a lot of smoke, and the lid can be taken on and off easily when you go to clean it. The only problem that you might run into is that the electric cord, in my opinion, is a little bit short. I didn't run into any issues with it, but if you have a bigger space, you might. Um, so if you're in the market for an electric skillet and you're at Walmart, I would definitely give that one a shot. If you do, let me know. But until then, guys, I appreciate you watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye.